Good evening everyone, Ace Carvies here, back with another video. Today we are reviewing the 1958 Edsel Citation Convertible. Now this is pink, if you cannot tell by the camera, it is a pink Edsel. Really, really like Edsels, even though a lot of people think they're really ugly because of that front grill, but I think it looks great, if you ask me. But, without further ado, let's get into the vid. We do have, starting off, we do have very nice trim going across the door and around the Edsel all back there. And it does say Citation. We got some lights here. Very, very detailed. I bought this car for 25 bucks. It's very hard to find. A pink Edsel, you can find them in other colors, but the pink one is, like, the coolest to me. And it's pretty funny how I found this car. I was at a toy show in, uh, Kalamazoo, Michigan. Oh! And I was looking, uh, there was something gold. So I went to go see that. And I ended up seeing this instead, and it was way cooler. And, uh, yeah, it's pretty interesting, and I tried to negotiate with the girl for 20 but I got it for 25 which is still a pretty good steal. No, but we are in the interior, and there are buttons on the, co the steering wheel. That is how you work the transmission. It's a push-button transmission, and you push it on the steering wheel. It's really, really cool. So you think the book push transmissions we have now is brand new heck no this was back in 1958 and if you try to say something else fight me I dare you not really I really don't care for drama so but still you wanna go we'll go square up but yeah as you can see we got a nice radio in there very very detailed interior Got a lot of chrome on there. Does say citation on the glove box. This actually has power windows. So, see, even power windows aren't new. This what car had power windows. Very, very detailed automobiles. We got some antennas back here. And we got these very nice rims that have a pink inner. And they do have a E in the middle of the wheel, but the camera won't pick it up. This is textured. We got nice white walls. I just love how the car is so swoopy. It just swoop. Very, very nice. Let's pop open the hood. It is rear hinged, and it, just, it uh, reveals the big V8 engine sitting in there. We got battery, the fan, and actually... I don't know if it'll pick it up, but the radiator is gold, like a brass copper color. Very, very, very detailed. Or oh, filter, and a few other things. Brake. It looks like the starter right there, I'm pretty sure. Oh, no. A lot of things are on the firewall. There. Got the big battery. Very, very detailed automobile. Highly recommend. You can get this in whatever color you want. I can't remember what colors they come in. But here we have the front. That has the ring. And Edsel. And we got grill on the side. I just love the look of this car to be honest. It just looks so cool to me. Like I would not want anything else. Snap. And we do have reversed head uh the windshield wipers facing each other so they wipe outward. And the seats do have a nice pattern on them. We got the boot. So a very, very boot. And we go to the back where I love the look of the taillights. Like I just love how they like they just swoop in. I just think that looks really, really nice. And I think these are the turn signals here or reverse lights. And 
the exhaust pipes actually go through, but they kind of goofed on that. I don't can't remember. Those might actually, I might be making a mistake. I'm not sure if they actually go through or not, but yeah. They definitely do on my 57 and, uh, T-Bird. If you haven't seen that video, go watch it. What are you doing? Go watch it, please. And here we have the spare tire and quite roomy trunk. Very, very nice quality. This is by Road Signature, I think. I'm, I can't remember. Uh, it's underneath the car, but we'll get there in a minute. Here's the other side. Let's uh, open the door. The door handles actually go through, so you can actually stick your tools in there. Here's a better view of the interior. Honestly, I like the cars where the mirror is actually on the dashboard. I just think that looks better, if you ask me. And as you can see, the brake... I don't think you can see them, but they're there. Brake pedals and stuff. Yep, there we go. There are the brake pedals down there. And let's uh, turn that back. There are the gauges. Very, very detailed. We got ash trays in the back seat. That way, I mean, you want to smoke. Why the heck would you want to smoke? I don't know. If you want to die, I guess. But I, I swear, you better not smoke around me unless you want me to die because I'm allergic to the fumes. I legit break out in hives. It's a mess. And, yeah. And I'm already a mess to begin with. So, to make me more look, look more like a wreck is just terrible. Alright, and underneath, we have the underside with the colored mufflers and the oil pan. Very, very nice detail down here. Highly recommend this car. So, if you can find it in a good color for a cheap price, I recommend you buy it. But yeah, be sure you guys leave a like, subscribe down below, and hit that little notification bell so you don't miss every time that I upload a video. And um, yeah, I'll see you in the next. Peace out.